welcome back to TYTT Adventures. Trey started a new cooking class after school, so here's some recipes. Enjoy! Trey said maybe you can start off with what ingredients we have, um, and then we can kind of break it down to what to do. Okay, so first you're gonna need a pot for, cause oh wait, cause today we are gonna be making pasta chicken alfredo. Yeah. And so first you need a pot with some hot water, and do we we need the salt first? So, so oh, over there, the pink salt, okay. right there. Oh, this. Yep. Okay. Okay. Some salt that we got from Ross the other day. Let me open this. We like the Himalayan salt because hmm? it's healthier than the regular manufactured one. Um, in the meantime, this is not part of that. Also, I was so happy that I got you one sauce. This is the first time in my life and it's my favorite sauce in the whole entire world, but it's expensive. And I just recently was like, you know what? I just want it so bad. Also, don't mind this. Um, <laughs> wow. Okay, so first thing we have, gotta have the penne pasta. Well, any pasta. Any pasta. But I like this one. Okay, so chef's oh. choice. Uh, um, salt. We got some heavy these. cream. To be honest, I don't know what the difference is between heavy whipping cream and heavy cream, but that's the only thing Target had, so I got it. Um, um, we need an onion, garlic, cloves, but. I got minced garlic to make it easier for us. I was struggling, trying to wonder how do you open this when all you do is pop this off. Oh. <laughs> so. Oh, also, yeah, garlic salt, yeah? Um, and I just got onion powder because it's good to have. Um, What else did we, oh, chicken, which I'm gonna defrost really quick. And, boneless? yep, what kind of tree? What kind of chicken? Boneless chicken dress. Boneless chicken breasts. Let's like put that. No. Um, anything in here? Oh, I'm stoked. I'm gonna make that after. <laughs> I think that's it. Yeah, so you get the pot, fill it with water. Okay. And hot you wanna, water. Uh, no. Uh, do we put it on high? Because you wanna yeah. make the water hot and boiling, right? Uh, You want me to turn it on or you got it? Mm. Yeah, that's the one. So when you're cooking, always make sure that you're turning the right knob because we want to make sure that it's that one, not the other one. Anyway, so go for it, Trey. This also have to add some salt into it. Did they tell you why you have to add salt? So before, I did not know when the water was boiling or not. I just figured out when the water is boiling, there should be some bubbles like going like like around the pot, and then um, when it's like fully boiling, it, bubbles will start like floating up. <laughs> but while we for that, uh, do we have something like to stir that? Like, okay. like, how's it looking? Starting to bubble up. There has to be like pretty choke bubbles in Oh, and then you pour the pasta in? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, do we have some oil? Mm-hmm. You want olive oil or... Yeah, olive oil should be good. You have to put it in here? Well, there's a lady that said, oh, you should put just like a little bit. Oh, okay, so it doesn't stick to the bottom? Yeah, so it doesn't stick to the bottom. It usually... It, it should be enough. Yeah, oil and water doesn't combine. Are you melting hot? You put it in and you touch the spoon? <laughs> Sticky finger inside. No, no. Okay, maybe you can start pouring okay, the yeah, stuff in, yeah? You know, it's funny, I usually, when I make noodles, I don't pour it, like I don't wait. I pour the noodles in when it's still cold. Okay. Yeah, pour the whole thing in, it's okay. I'm trying to make sure there's no squish. Mm. Okay, there. Okay. 
I feel like the salt and oil helps it not like bubble over, yeah? Mm. I think that's what Lola told me before, but I could be wrong. In the meantime, while we're waiting for the noodles to boil, Fourth of an onion. Okay, that was a little on the way. Yeah, yeah. You have to, yeah, good. A fish? Mm -hmm. And then we'll put aside the other. Okay, what seasonings did you put into the chicken? I put garlic salt. Uh, some pepper and then mozzarella cheese but then the next thing we're gonna put in is some parsley but we have to cut it up first don't worry I wash my hands already we have to do most of the stuff off camera cuz but also we needed two hands. Good job, Trey. Um, if you want to, we can put more parsley on it. Um, I don't know if I want to go back out to the <laughs> plant, but yeah. I'm gonna also make some scallops after this. So, <laughs> good job, Tracen. <laughs> or Chef Tracen, thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Bye.